Hi everyone, it's Audrey. Welcome back to the channel. Uh, this is Colour and Chat. Uh, just a disclaimer, this is an adult channel and the videos on this channel are made for adults and are in no way, shape or form made for or intended for children. Today we're going to be having a chat and just continuing colouring in Tales from the Midnight Masquerade by Hannah Carlson. We're liking this book, aren't we, peeps? I like it, can't wait for her new one. There's only one I haven't got now and I'll be getting that in the new year. I'm going to be stopping by in very soon due to Christmas, so. So I'm just going to do her eyebrows. I'm going to do them slightly darker um, yellow. At the moment it looks like it's a lighter yellow, it will. But I shall put something else on over the top. So how are you all? Are you all staying nice and safe? I wanted to do this video earlier, but um, it's been a little bit crazy um, here. I've, I've had bad sinusitis again. This is because of the weather and I will admit that it is because of the weather. The weather is terrible. When the weather gets like this, I am ter terribly, terribly bad sinusitis headaches. And um, I've got one right now, actually. I'm not going to, I've got one at the moment, but it's, it's not too bad. So as long as it doesn't get any worse, we'll be fine. So I have had a few bad ones. I was going to do this one yesterday, but I was feeling absolutely dreadful. So we are just doing this one now. Most of this will now be um, glitter gel pen and some pencil just here, uh, just to fill it in. But uh, yes, yeah, so I've not been feeling 100%. I am all right now. Um, yeah. So I don't know what it's like where you are, but I hope you are all staying lovely and safe. Um, we're staying as safe as we possibly can, um, doing everything we can to stay at uh, home and not come into contact with too many people. Still, it's, it's still going on, but it's just a matter of being careful. So I have had a bad month on eBay, I've hardly sold anything. I'm not going to lose money, I'm actually in profit but only just. Um, I'm probably in profit more if I had my um, eBay payments on daily. I've got them on weekly just because having them on daily means I've got to uh, uh, go into eBay, uh, well I go into eBay every day anyway, that's obvious. But I've also got to go into enter it into my QuickBooks, which is fine when it was through PayPal because it would automatically pull through. But for some reason, it doesn't automatically pull through when it goes into my bank account. And I don't know why. So I've got to manually input it and I found I was doing it a, a while back, ever so much, all the time. Um, so I changed it to weekly so I'd only have to do it on a Tuesday or a Wednesday. So it pays out on a Tuesday and then I've only got to go in on, say, Wednesday and uh, <clears throat> and pop it in uh, but I haven't had many sales and that's my fault for not listing um, I have listed a few things I've had three sales which is great and, and they're going out tomorrow they also over the weekend um, I did list five on a weekend I've listed five today and I've got five ready for tomorrow that I've just got to go in tweak about and, and do <clears throat> so rather than me try and go crazy and get everything done in one go I'm just gonna do photograph and draft six items every day so that's five that I can list the next day with one over so that if I have a day off for whatever reason I've got one or two or three maybe that I can just put up because oh there we go I didn't you know have time or you know I've still got something to, to do so that's why what I've been doing so so that's that's done so hopefully I mean now I start listing every day I've got a ton of stuff to list so I do need to crack on with it 
I've got a, a digital camera here to test. It's not going to be very high end. Um, there's a memory card in it, so I'm interested to see if there's any photos on it and what they're of. I might let you know. That's more likely to be in the weekly vlog. But uh, that's if it even works. The camera might not even work. It had it only takes AA batteries, which is unusual for digital cameras. Sometimes they take AA or triple A's. But most of the time they take proprietary ones. This one doesn't. And it's a Canon one. Just having a look at it because it's up here. It's a Canon Power Shot S3IS. I have no idea. I don't have a clue how many meta. It's a, it's just a camera. It's, it's oh, it's a 12 optical zoom, six megapixels. So it's not a huge amount. It's an old camera, but hey, I'll have a look at it. I'll use it. And I'm gonna give it to Jen to use to play with. She loves playing with cameras. But, uh, I only ever give a broken one, so she plays and fiddles with them. She knows what they are. She knows what they do. She loves taking photographs of herself with my phone. Then I can never find any of the pictures I need for me. eBay. I very much doubt it's worth anything. I might look it up once I've tested it if it's working. Because the worst thing would be to... Um, check how much it is, find it's actually worth something and then it not work. If it works it's not worth anything, it doesn't bother me because I'll just put it in with my stock of cameras to use occasionally. So, but I, you know, out and about with Jen because I don't want to uh, necessarily ruin everything. So. Mm. I love the purples in here. What colour is that? It's grape. That's purple. Yes, yeah, a dark purple. That's great. Perfect. Bluey purple colour. I love these Black Widow pencils. I've just ordered. I had a £30 voucher from work for Christmas because we normally have a Christmas party and they give us £30 to spend. And um, obviously with everything's going on we're not having a Christmas party they gave us the option to um, have a virtual party nobody wanted to do that donate it to charity or have a voucher and I thought well I work hard so I'm gonna have the voucher and I'm gonna order myself some stuff off of uh, Amazon now I ordered oh Jennifer's crying a colouring book and two more sets of Black Widows, um, but the, the skin tones. So I've ordered the both the light and dark because they were on offer, I guess, for Black Friday. Oh, she's all right. I do like the way these pencils work in this book. I hope they like this on all the paper. Uh, yeah, so I've ordered myself another set of the light and dark skin tones using my voucher. And then hopefully in the new year I'll get another set of Monarchs because I love them. Uh, this one I'm using now, the Lavender, this is from the Monarchs, the Monarch set. I mean, yes, I could just go and order odd pencils from Albert. But I think the cost of getting them over here from Australia, individual, would be just as expensive as buying a complete new set. And it may come now once I've got two sets of them on the go. And if it's the same colours running all the time, that yeah, I might say, okay, I don't really want another set. I will order them this time from 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 Albert at Medi Health. It'd be great if you got a stockist over here. It's 
sometimes she does wake up like that and cries and then goes back to sleep. So. Oh, she's a sweetheart. She's had a good day in nursery, that's the main thing. She should sleep tonight, at least I hope so. It worries me when she doesn't. That might have been a bit of hair, but I'm not going to worry too much about that. So Christmas is coming, so I know that in December, once I get my November pay, I'm not going to be able to buy any colour and stuff. It's, it's, I've got to get everybody's Christmas presents first. I mean, we're not buying a lot for everybody because, well, we're just not. Nobody's got any money. And obviously we've got a Jennifer to buy for. Paul will probably get me a couple of colouring books. And I've got my, that was my Sakura jelly rolls falling on the floor. I'll pick them up in a minute uh, when we need them. Um, I forgot what I was going to say. I've got my um, Colour in Heaven. I've ordered him the new Paul McCartney CD because he loves Paul McCartney. Um, so I'm happy to get him that. Oops. So that's what I've got him uh, at the moment. We will get each other some other bits and pieces. Yeah. But. I haven't got anything for my mum and dad, or, and he hasn't got anything for his mum or dad yet. Though this year it's all going to be from both of us. I mean, I usually get my mum and dad alcohol or something like that. I mean, what I want to get is too expensive. I might get that for her birthday instead, and I'll say, I'll get it for your birthday, mum. It's too expensive at Christmas with Jennifer. And then, of course, because I can't use up December's pay, because in January I've got Jennifer's birthday at the end of the month and Paul's birthday at the beginning. So, I, you know, I've got to make sure I've got money to get Jennifer some birthday presents as well. Which... And she needs clothes because she's growing out of her two to three. She's quite tall, her body's quite long, so all her t-shirts are riding up. So she really needs some new, longer t-shirts. She's already, some of her pyjamas are already the next size. I'm gonna get her, and I'll get her a pair for Christmas Eve. It's not a tradition we've ever done because my dad's birthday is Christmas Eve. So Christmas Eve was always about him, but I don't see why I can't get her a pair of nice pyjamas to wear. Because she's gonna need them anyway. <laughs> I won't get Christmas themed ones, I think things like that. Unless you can wear them every year. So for instance, I could wear one every year. But with Jennifer, she'll be out and she'll be in the next size next Christmas. It seems a waste. But I can get her a, a set of pajamas that she can wear Christmas Eve, new ones. And then she can have another, she can wear them all year. So that's my plan. I'm enjoying this picture. Yes, it's a very nice one. I like this picture. So, at the moment, this month is looking very much like it's all Jade Summer books, apart from one and this one. Although I've nearly finished another picture. Which is a colouring heaven. I've got a load of colouring heavens on the go as well. Oh, I'm so tired. Saying that, we've got a whole week yet, and I'm laying off the jade now. <laughs> Trying to do some other stuff instead. So I've got one I'm finishing off. I hope we finish that the next day or so, which is the one for the Arteza. Oh, what's it? Ones. Experts, the 120 set of artists, experts. Um, so I'm just finishing that off. That I hopefully will finish tomorrow. Um, 
and I've got another one I'm doing the Zodiac special which I'm doing with the Black Widows so that's my one next one to try and get that finished and then it'll be I'll have a look at what other whips I've got and see what I can do try and work my way through them I, I mean I haven't even started anything Christmassy yet I know a lot of colourists are already going mad on the Christmas but I will get bored if I do too many so I will be doing them do you want to see a complete set of Christmas colouring books because I can if you want I mean, I haven't bought the newest Jade Summer ones because they're going to be putting them out in grayscale in December. Chibi and Kawaii. Kawaii's uh, out. Chibi's coming out this week, I believe. I want the Kawaii one in grayscale, I do. And Chibi. So I'm trying to wait for them. But I have bought... I have bought a couple. Got one on the way, which is the one I ordered with my voucher. And uh, one that arrived this month. So that's real good. That's um, my head saying, yeah, that it's all coming on. I will be doing a background on this. I've got an idea for what I'm going to do, but whether or not I actually do it on camera depends on how long it takes me to do the jelly rolls. I don't think it will because I don't want to do a long video today. I'm already at nearly 20 minutes. It's because my head's hurting and I want to try and get some sleep. And the background's something I can do tomorrow when I'm sitting in bed colour in before I go to sleep when I'm doing my my relaxing because I use colour in to just wind down after a hard day I still got to do some more of my Johanna Basford calendar I don't know that for ages I might do that tomorrow I think they're supposed to be leaves but I've done them as sort of feathery things I just think they look nice And of course anything can be whatever you want it to be, so okay, they're actually leaves, but I quite like them purple. Yeah, I like that. It's a nice colour. Right, that's the monarch. Let's put that one back where that one lives. And let's put this one back where this one lives. That's all of that. I'm going to get the gel pens now and we'll have a yeah, I've got to rescue them off the floor, so I'll be back in a minute. Okay, sorry about that. Everything's moved now, so move it all back. Right. Right, so I'm going to use some of these. Some of these again, we're going to use the um, glitter. Some of them we're going to use the metallics. I might use glaze. I might not. Right, where's that with the gold metallic, I think? On here. So, yeah, I mean. It's hard to know what to do, really, with them. Um, to see Baylark because obviously they're in lockdown in England so they're buying stuff online which is fine I don't have a problem with that because I love it if I, if I get sales <laughs> you know you can't see what I'm doing I do apologize the one thing I don't like is I don't like using these on camera because I can't get close enough to them because if I get close enough to them my head will be in the shop So, 
ting, jeg er. So it is hard. And I've been very undisciplined this month with eBay, I'm not going to lie, because I just haven't felt very well and up to it. I think it's partly the horrible weather. Because when I pack my items, it doesn't matter what time of day it is, it's pretty much dark. So I'm going to have to go back over this gold afterwards because... I can see gaps when I look on the camera, but I can't see them when I'm here. So it's very hard to do this, to be honest. Like this. <laughs> Put this one on, here we go. I will go over the gold again later. Probably when I do the background, or just after I've done the background. I'm not saying much, I haven't really got a lot to say to be honest, I'm just enjoying the colouring and I really hope you guys are okay because we're fine here at the moment, we're not in lockdown in Wales, we are there are certain restrictions obviously but it's not so bad that we can't see people, we can't go to the shops, we can do all that, it's great. I mean we even went out for Sunday lunch the other day, it was lovely, I haven't been out for Sunday lunch for months. In fact I don't think I've been out for Sunday lunch this year. Me and Paul used to go out um, every Saturday to Newport and have lunch on Friars Walk say at Nando's or in one of the pubs such as Windsor Castle but it's just been very very hard as you know and uh, we've um, not really been able to do very much that's the problem over that one I need to. <sighs> it's very difficult knowing what to do. So Christmas coming and everything. I feel so sorry for people who live on their own. They've got no close family and perhaps just like going down to the pub for a pint was their way out. Or people in care homes who can't see their families and Things like that. It's quite sad. I mean, I think that the problem is that um, they're going on about, oh, we're going to have more restrictions after Christmas because of people getting together over Christmas. But the problem is people... I mean, I'm, I'm quite a loner. I don't mind being on my own. I'm quite happy being on my own. But humans aren't meant to be on their own all the time. We're not... We're not built like that. We're not built that way. So, for people to have to keep staying away from each other, it, it's not a natural thing for the human race to do. It, it's not. We're social creatures. 
and we're all doing our very best in very very difficult circumstances and they are very difficult circumstances and fair play I think those people who are abiding by the rules fair play to you you've been brilliant and and so have the NHS staff and all the medical staff from all over the world who are dealing with it I know there are people who don't believe it's as serious as we're being told and that's that's fine everybody's entitled to an opinion I think I'll just rather stay safe you know I've got a, a small child who depends on me I was so ill in 2019 that I don't did not want to risk it I mean I had five chest infections in 2019 part of that was coming back to work after maternity leave and living in a bubble like I am now um, I'm dreading going back to the office because I'm pretty sure I'm going to start getting ill again. I've only had a couple of days off sick this year and that's when I've physically not been able to work because I've been feeling so ill for whatever reason so oh, these colours are beautiful I quite like these jelly rolls they're expensive, but they're quite nice. Like I said, I save them for when I do books like this. Not for doing general patterns and things like that, you know, like when I get my glitters out and I'm just generally, I mean, I've got cheap glitter pens for that and they work really well, but I wouldn't want to. Oh, I understand you can get refills on this, but I don't know where in the UK. Anybody know in the UK where you can get refills for jelly rolls? If you know, leave me a comment down below. I was going to do normal coloured pearls, but I'm actually going to do purple glittery ones. I've actually enjoyed this one so yeah I won't be doing the background today because we're already 30 minutes in I was going to do a 30 minute video but uh, yeah, I've still got tons of this to do uh, the glittery one. so I might just do a bit more and then I'll finish it off off camera and I will definitely, obviously, do the. This purple's nice, isn't it? Look at that, that gorgeous colour. That goes well. Oh, yeah, I've got these bits to do, Danny. I've got these bits. <laughs> I'm an idiot. So I might just finish off her neck piece and then do a headpiece off camera. It's going to be exactly the same colours as I'm doing this in, so you're not going to be missing much. <laughs> just because I, I've got a headache and I want to go to bed as well. You know I do these normally late at night and it's no exception. It's getting on for 11 o'clock now and I need to get some sleep before work, but... Normally I would try and finish off, or oh, I guess I could do a headpiece on the background on the next one if you want, let me know. Because I am going to stop after I've done the neck piece, but if you want to see me do a headdress on the background in the next video, I could do that, I don't mind. Or if you want to see something new, that's fine too. Just let me know what you think down in the comments below. Do you want me to finish this one in the background? With the background on camera or do you want me to start something new? I'm happy either way. I'll probably finish it on camera. Because there's still a fair bit to do with her headdress. So... I 
that's one thing in a book like this you could use loads of glitter pen and you know that sort of glittery stuff because it's a masquerade ball and the whole book is going to be covered in it isn't it yeah glitter and metallics it's oh it's amazing problem is there are so many books i want but I'm also a member of groups of that have got free colouring pages and oh my god, I would never, I don't actually need to ever buy a book again. I mean that would be amazing wouldn't it, you never buy a book again but you've always got something new to colour. And then you would just buy, if you wanted to, books by certain artists like Johanna Basford or she's got a new one out next year, Hannah Lynn's got a new one coming out soon and so on. The ones that don't do the free and then just fill in the gaps with the rest of the freebies. But uh, yeah. Right, that's going to be it for tonight. Let's have a look at what we've done. So, you know, it's been about 32 minutes I think. 30 minutes maybe. But I have got a headache and I need to go to bed. So um, take some painkillers. I will finish this off in the next one. And if it takes a bit longer than half an hour, that's fine. I haven't got a problem. I just wanted to put a video out because I promised to do this last week and then I wasn't well enough and I'm still not feeling brilliant. But hey, I've done it. So in the next video, we will do all this headdress and we will do the background. And I'm going to use the pebbles chalks and then I will spray it so that it doesn't. And I'll put something on that page so it doesn't. Um, leak over onto that page because I don't want it to obviously leak onto the page but she is looking pretty lovely uh, you know she's rather nice isn't she that's it for tonight I do hope you've enjoyed this video I'm sorry it's only a short one guys but I'm really not feeling too brilliant um, let me know what you think down below and I will see you in the next video very very soon bye guys <laughs>